and then they released that second one. I forgot which which song it was, but yeah, no, it's just crazy. But like, I just want everything, like, cause I'm not. I started off as a producer, so yeah. I wasn't like yeah. a visual nigga like that. You feel me? <laughs> so it's like not done. Rapping, you mm -hmm. feel me? Now I gotta get the whole visual study done. Like, Not that much. A whole package for real. You feel me? Packaging it up. Yeah. With the right people that I feel like they have good talent, you feel me? Absolutely, yeah. I fuck with that, bro. Like, trying to expand everything for sure. Yeah, uh, like, I'm fake, like, I'm fake anti-social as fuck, so it's like, I be having to, like, break out my shit. Yeah. Because I be wanting to do everything myself. Like, if I could... Like, if I can hold that camera, edit, do it, like, if I really could, I'd do yeah. it all myself, but it's like, it's no point in that. Like, I'm, it's, it's good to collaborate, you feel me? Yeah. And like, just fuck with like people that hard like, shit. I wouldn't even have this if I wouldn't have, you feel me? Yeah. Collaborate. Yeah, definitely. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. I heard Tyler created, it was over with, you feel me? Like, he's the reason why I even do what I do. Yeah. 
do any of this shit when it comes to music. Like, yeah. I always loved music, but once I heard his shit, his beats, like, it was like, it did something to me, bro. Yeah. Like, you you just I was know? Like, it was like, nah, I gotta do this. Like, I gotta, I wanna hear this like, every day. You know what I mean? And it was like, can't listen to that nigga all day because I'm an arrogant nigga. I love my life. So it's like, fuck him. Well, not fuck him. I love Tyler. Tyler loved me. I didn't have a couple times. But it was like, nah, I can't listen to him all day. So I got to I gotta do it myself. Exactly. So like, I used to watch like <clears throat> his little piano tutorials and shit. It was this nigga named, uh, you get some good shit right now because the OG fans, they don't know. It was this nigga named North Park Productions. Like in 2011, 2012, he used to do all the title of first piano tutorials. And that's why I learned to play a lot of title songs. And that's why I got like a lot of my like chords and shit for like that built my whole sound basically. Yeah. Like my whole original Icy Twat like signature sound. Like it came from me mixing like Metro Zoo, Tyler the Creator, and they said Rocky, like, just all my influences in one. Even Lex Luger, like, I was a big Waka Flock fan. So get a snatch, I like sluts, I like flats. If I take this by, I ain't calling you back. I'm in the meeting, they know that I'm smack. They still trying to sign me, they know that I'm not. I know I gotta put it on for the team. The city and city ain't got it on wax. I know I gotta put it on for the team, cause I can't just go back to sit on my ass. Uh, uh, uh. I just gotta go put the team on my back. Hey, uh, uh, uh. I just gotta go put the team on my back. I gotta go put the team on my. Uh, I gotta go put the. Uh, I gotta go put the team on my back. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Like, I was just like, my, I want to be Quincy Jones. 
this shit. Like, I never wanted to be a rapper. It just happened, yeah, I just started rapping. But, like, I really want to do some Quincy Jones shit the way like, I made it out for people. <clears throat> like, that's even what I wanted to do. So, like, all that other shit happened. I wanted to build albums for people, you feel me? Like, curate their whole album, produce their whole album. Mm-hmm. Sequence it through all that. Cause I feel like I got a good head for shit. You know what I mean? And I'm just like, fuck it. Like, these niggas don't see the vision. Exactly. And then it'd be like, a lot of people don't see the vision until I get on it. Like, yeah. I'll rap on some shit. And then nigga be like, oh, I want some shit like that. And it's like, nigga, I just sent you <laughs> some shit like that. Like, fuck, like, I just sent you that same beat. And now you're gonna rap with it. Like, shit, you mean?
Cause it's like, nothing else to do, bro. Like, if you really want to win, I'm gonna keep it Cause I'm not even where I really want to be. Like, I'm good as hell, but it's like, I want to be a superstar. But it's like, if you really want this shit, bro, you gotta work every day, bro. I just made 30 songs in seven days, man. You feel me? And that's not even including beats. Like, I don't even want to talk about beats. I make fucking 10 beats in an hour, bro. Like, I don't even want to know that since I was 14. But it's like, for anybody that look up to me, I don't want you to think that, oh, Twat doing this because of the drugs, too. Because when I was 14, and when I was 17, making all the shit y'all like when y'all like talk me about by the Cardi shit and all the December shit and all that, I was completely sober. So when you sober or high, you don't, you feel me? Nobody make fire music and you make the best shit. You can still go crazy regardless, you feel me? You don't need to be high to make fire music. But I'm in beat. <laughs> and when I be 